So it's fun to be here on the 20 year anniversary. At Mozilla, we're coming up to our 15 year anniversary, and so 20 years seems like a big achievement. In my um, very short visit so far, I've already seen a couple things about the center and its activities that remind me of Mozilla. One of those is learning by doing and by having fun. The idea that trying things out, making some mistakes, trying them out again, working, having some fun and laughing while you do it is a really effective way to learn new things. So learning by doing is really an important part of how we learn. And to do that really well, it helps to have a community of people around you that have similar interests or at least supporting you. And so we try to do both of those things at Mozilla. We try to do both of those things with Firefox. And we try to do both of those things with our new offerings like Popcorn and Thimble, which will have some so we build, we build our products. You know, we build Firefox to have a great user experience online. But we also build Firefox to build freedom into the very foundation of the internet. And to do that, learning by doing and building with the community are essential. So Mozilla is a nonprofit organization, as I said, building freedom into the internet. And we, we do this because we can tell that the internet is fundamental to life, or increasingly fundamental to how we live our lives. And so the technology has an immense impact on the degree of freedom that we might have in the future. And that code is similar to legal code. With legal code, we have legislators and policy, and we make rules that we live by and that govern our lives, legal code. And so the, so the decisions of the people who write software and create the internet affect our lives in ways that are increasingly strong. Yep. And so at Mozilla, we work to build product, but we work to teach people or to provide an opportunity for people to learn about software and to learn about the internet by doing and by having fun. There's a group here that feels that the internet should be presented in Catalan and in a Catalonian style and with a sensitivity to all of the issues that are important. And so that community of people creates Firefox in Catalan and participates in the global organization and governance of the Firefox projects as members of a local community. And so if you should have interest in how Firefox is presented in Catalan and what goes along with it, you are welcome to become participants and ultimately leaders of that effort. And um, I think the leader of the, that community, Alina, is one, and the technical leader will be here later for the workshops today. And so it's easy to learn like how one gets involved and how one can learn deep technical skills if you want to. We try to have a range of things that are fun and easy and that progress into real technical expertise for those who are interested. And for those of us who have an interest in our own lives and our own content and how we create our photos and our images and how we present ourselves to the world, we have other projects besides Firefox which help each one of us actually have a, uh, uh, understand more and have a richer experience. And those will have some workshops later today that you're welcome to stop by and, and see what it's like to sort of get your hands inside the web and make some changes and feel like you have really the power of the web in your hands. And so the spirit of the center here of creating one's own projects, 
coming and doing things, trying them, learning new things, then that can extend as far into the web as we choose to make it. And so uh, it's exciting to see the uh, people who come to do such things, and I wish you the best of luck and another great 20 years.